How we doing today, YouTube? Welcome back to Gino's Let's Plays Diablo 1 Part 4, baby. Oof. We're getting into the depths of hell. It's getting crazy. We're going to get into it. It's going to be a little bit of a shorter episode. My recording window is a little shortened at the moment, but we're going to get straight into it. So here we are currently where we left off. If you haven't been watching the last episode, this is what our gear is looking like at the moment. Not bad. Not bad. But definitely could make some upgrades. For sure. So, let's leave our money on the ground. Let's leave this uh, magic over here because we're almost going to level up anyways. And let's go forward. So, um, what is it looking like? It's looking like we're going into level 8 and maybe 9 this episode. We'll see. So, level 8... I don't think we have much left of of uh, what's it called of quests in the catacombs I don't believe we can get the armor quest which we found pretty good armor so I'm content with that um, and honestly I don't remember any other quests that happen later in level 8 or 9 um and I'm pretty sure... I'm trying to think, does 9 start the cave? I don't think so, I think 10 starts the cave. I don't know, but the cave is where it gets freaking scary. Our resistances aren't bad, especially our lightning resistance is really good, but I think the main thing we want is that fire resistance. Because in the cave, I know there's lightning and I know there's fire. And the fire one is the scary one. Here we are, what do we got here? Town Shrine. I'm assuming that gives us town teleportal, but just to double check, where's the T T T T T town shrine? Hellfire only, cast a town teleporter. Okay, kind of sucks, but take it, rags, and that goes to nine. Oof! All right, well we know we're gonna, where we're gonna go. What the? F whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, guys. I don't like this at all. I don't like this at all. I don't like this. Okay, it's a boss. I see. Yep, that's the boss. They're also pretty hard to hit. Thing is, I'm close to a level up. And I wonder if this is glitching or if, it, like, it's a thing that you just can barely... You can only see these guys when they're in your face. Okay, we're getting too surrounded. Sorry, I just don't want to be. We're taking too much, taking too much, taking too much damage. Keep going. No. You, dude? Baron Sludge? I don't like you at all. I don't want to re waste these rejuice. Shit, dude. Oh, my God. Let's go back up real quick. 
fuck. And I don't have a town teleporter. I guess these Rejuves are gonna be up next. I can't heal, can I? No. This would be nice if I could use it. I don't think I have the magic to be able to use it though. Nope, we're gonna do the smart thing. We're gonna go back to town. And we're gonna get a lot of health potions. Damn, okay. Well, this episode isn't starting off like I, like I would've hoped. Oh man, that sucks. What ails you, my friend? Do you sell anything fancy? No. Okay. I think that would be enough. Okay. I'm gonna take a couple of these for a teleporter back. Okay. God, these dumb mud men, dude. Hello? There, there. Dude, this guy better give me a gold fucking item. Holy shit. Is another one done? No, 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 no. Nope, 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 nope. I think we're slowly starting to win this fight. We got a bow. It is blue, but it's a bow. I gotta pawn some of this stuff. It could be good. Good enough to replace both our weapons? I don't think so, but... Could be something. That's a wrap. No. No, you're not running away. Get over here. Get over here. God. Okay, we're about to kill away from a level up. Now we have amazing lightning resistance. These guys aren't that scary anymore. There's our level. More mud men. No. I don't think I've ever had mud men as an enemy, and I hate them. I might have time for just one episode, it looks like. Or maybe it's time for us to start looking for a weapon. Something that's gonna bring our hit chance up. And do more damage. Health it is. Our health has 80 right now. We get plus almost 40 in that aspect. What do we got here? Oh yeah, it's a town shrine. That's right. <laughs> Jeez. I think they are worth pretty good experience, though. I wonder why the one guy was invisible, though, and these guys aren't. Okay. 
We'll wait. Tail of the three. Okay, that's just ring Too mail. Much baggage. I mean, it would have been amazing if it was blue, but hey, hey. We fought a lot of unseen. Get in. What is this in here? Quiet shrine. Okay. We'll look up what that does. Quiet shrine. of vitality well if we didn't have enough health already no magic resistance oh it's goat archers why have I why am I so happy to see you guys <laughs> searching which I think we can actually learn these are hitting us a lot more than get over here Get over here. Come on. There we go. What scroll did he drop? There it is. Healing. Very nice. Yes. Dude, our health. I don't think I've ever had health this high. My lord. It's filthy. I heard him open the door. Okay. I think... Oh, wow. I don't want to aggro everyone in the bookcase room. They're so clear. Please don't. Can you come over here and not open that door, please? Thank you. Too much well, baggage. I guess we'll go back now. Long battle bow. Okay. There we go. Oh, we got a shrine. But honestly, we're going to have to go back again anyways. Let's go. So we got two blue battle bows that we can see what comes from it. It might be worth keeping one around just for having to deal Hello, with ranged enemies. Stay a while and listen. 14 of strength. Lightning arrow damage. Interesting. That's the one that the boss dropped. Plus, eh, it's, it's not that great. Yeah. Okay. Let's sell. <laughs> Whoa! What can I do for you? Ring mail, two twenty-five, seventeen, two thousand. Okay. Not bad. I want to see something. 
Okay, it just gives you mana. Cool. Let's just organize this a little bit. Our stuff's getting a little crazy in here. A lot of scrolls. I have a lot of scrolls of healing. I'm gonna start using those. I mean, we have a lot of scrolls of healing. Yeah. Let's just do that for now. I mean, six scrolls of healing. Jesus. Alright. Let's get this bookcase done. Oh no, it's mud man. Did you give a thousand XP though? And I think I'm smelling a level up coming from here. It's not that bad when they're all in together like this, you know? It's actually really not that bad at all. Oh, I am so far away from a level. I thought I was close. I need an extra... Yeah, no. Not at all. Claymore. What does a Claymore look like? Ooh, fancy. I think in this game, a Claymore is actually a one-handed uh, weapon. Man, we got a rude... Oh, there's still a lot. What the hell? Oh, I'm hitting control. We got a rude awakening and entrance into this level, but it's not too bad right now. Yeah, look at their hit points. 50 to 62. And sometimes we get hit for only 9. Yeah, we need a better weapon for sure. Because it's 9, but this weapon I think is 1 to 10. So if we even got like a small boost from that one minimum damage to like four, four times nine, you know what I mean? Like, it would help. God, these big boys. Yeah, this weapon's not gonna do for going into the caves with it. We're gonna definitely have to switch it up. Good thing we got a... Oh my lord. Say, good thing we got a shit ton of money. But could you imagine if we blew our money and then... We got into this level and we had to fight that boss and we couldn't buy health potions? We would have been bricked. It would have been pretty much impossible. that everyone? Nice. Give me books. Give me books. Give me books. God damn it. Lightning. We can actually learn that. Damn, I might start investing in magic, dude, at this point. Like... But I would want, like, a good magic spell, like, like firewall or something. Something that can clear... There we go. Come on, boys. No quests, though. No quests. Okay. I feel like we've done so much, but we've literally only done like three rooms. That's the crazy part. <sighs> Alright, what do we got here? I got a lot of scrolls of healing that I need to use. Uh, excuse me? Okay, next, we're getting closer to the next level, but still pretty distant. Yeah, it's just that armor that needs, or that defense, not defense, attack that needs to go up. I see a mudman. 
See a couple mud men. Very nice. Ooh. I gotta pawn some of this stuff. Crash. Alright. Scimitar might actually be worth something. I mean, they're all white items, so I'll definitely drop them for a blue item. <laughs> if we find any blue items. Oh, boy! Okay. Almost done with this level. That is going to be more lore. Let's go over this way first. Nice. I forgot these guys were in this level. Dolum. That goes back into the lore room. All right. What do we got here? A couple of these guys. I was about to say, where's the boss of this level, but <laughs> kind of ran into the big cheese first, huh? Man. Uh, look at that. Look how many scrolls, Jesus Christ. Yeah, we'll go sell some. Oh my God, is there enough for you guys? I see a mud man. At this point, these, like, smaller dudes, I can tank fairly, fairly well. Glory and approbation to Diablo, okay. Lord of Terror and leader of the three. My lord spoke to me of his two brothers, Mephisto and Baal, who were banished to this world long ago. My lord wishes to bide his time and harness his awesome power so that he may free his captive brothers from their tombs beneath the sands of the east. Once my lord releases his brothers, the Sin War will once again know the fury of the three. Which, it's kind of crazy that they read about that, because that's exactly where Diablo 2 pretty much is, from my understanding. I'm going to be very interested to kind of hear the lore in Diablo 2. Quite a lot of big boys. I can't carry anymore. Bowshin. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Cool. Ooh, help. I gotta pawn some of this stuff. How about that? We got a bookshelf. And a lovely goat shrine. Let's just get into it. No, no, no. He's gone. I got a pawn some of this blue stuff. rope. I got a pawn some. Oh of this my god. Uh, axe. Okay. Blue robe we will take instead of the damn bow. Where did it go? There it is. Let's see. The way is made clear when you view from above. Okay, this just gave us a world map, which honestly, I gotta pawn some of this. Not stuff. the greatest thing. Not the greatest thing. It's the bow we dropped. What's here? That's the axe, and that's money over there. I 
I hate when it gives you a map because I don't, I forget what I did not discover. We got a bookcase here. We've killed a lot of these dudes. 61? Jesus. There we go. Okay. Remember that Shrine for Town teleporter that we just never used? Okay. Too Way much more. baggage. Long sword. What does the long sword look like? I don't think I've ever seen a long sword. Ooh, that looks cool. Probably worth more money than that. Two to ten. Very nice. No scrolls, just a book. Ring of Fire sounds like money. Alright, let's get rid of some of these scrolls. It's about time. It is more than about time. Hello, my friend. Stay a while and listen. Minus for any light radius, but good fire res. Well, what can I do for you? How is he gonna view that though? As okay, play more. How's that longsword? Eh. Sharpness, blacksmith oil. Which one's the oil? Well, what can I do for you? Let's go sell a bunch of this stuff. Mana shield we can sell. Searchings we'll keep. The healths we'll keep, and we'll sell the inner sight. I sense a soul in search of answers. Envision searching. We have a lot of mana shields. Okay, we'll sell a couple of those. Golem. It's definitely better. Definitely better. Okay. We'll grab that book. I think that's it for that level. I think that level's done. We also can talk to Griswold and see if he has anything new. I totally forgot what about that. You, my friend? Let's see what you got for me, buddy. Well, what can I do for you? You got anything? That helm is almost done for being for sale. Soldier's axe. Lail. Hammer of the moon. Pretty. Wow. Fucking nothing, dude. Nothing. How about basic? Nothing really great. Wow. Well, let's continue forward. We won't go to peg leg until we're literally like... I could learn Ring of Fire. Might be worth it. Okay, so we got all of that. We went here. Did we get everything in here? I think we did. Yeah, because we went down there. That's everything. We went there first, yeah. This was seven. This is nine. Is nine gonna be the cave? Fuck. It's hot down here. Yeah, we're getting closer to hell, boys. Oh, boy. 
126 gold. Hunter's bow, that's blue. Okay, we just have goat men. And we got acid spitters. Dude, the item drop rate is getting crazy. Mana shield. Ooh, mana shield is a book. Full health. Carry anymore. Dude, we just found a bunch of stuff. And we can learn mana shield. Is my magic that good? It's 27. It's not bad. Wow. There's bow. Okay. Okay. Stuff's getting crazy. How many? I only have one searching, so... I'll save it. I saw a lot of boys here, though. Where'd they go? Anything in here? I don't see anything. And you're gonna see me do a lot of saves. Oh my god, a ring. I got a pawn. Staff of, of Guardian. Stuff. Oh Jesus. Yeah, it's taking four hits. Is that a full reju? I can't carry anymore. Okay, 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 okay. There is a shortcut to get back to town in this level, though. I gotta pawn some of this stuff. Too much baggage. God damn it. Okay. Stuff's getting real. Very nice level up. What are we going for? I think we go for strength. Okay, we got that damage boost. That was nice. Maybe it's like right there. Maybe it's right there. That's where the stairs are to get back up top. Maybe not. That's the time. God damn it. This isn't the worst pool of enemies, though. That's the thing. It definitely could have been a lot worse. We could have had the uh, Molted Lava Men. I don't know what their names are, but they're the least friendly of the bunch. And with us not having the greatest fire res could have been more dangerous in a sense. Just gonna chill there, chill there, chill there. Good. Okay, we got another bow guy there. Couple guys here. Let's go boys. Let's go boys. Yeah, I do want to get this guy. What are we looking at? More than a... Let's see how we're standing fight. About 800 a pop experience-wise for these guys. We're gonna have to back out. Too many projectiles. Good 
think these levels kind of have like a lot of shit in the way for these archers to get stuck on. I know a bow dropped over by those chests over there from one of the goat guys. Try and find it. First, I just want to get these guys dealt with. Get over here, dude. Yeah, this is why melee is annoying. It's like, look at this. Chase him across half the map just to hit him. Thank you. Jesus. All right, back to the chests I was talking about. It's just white. Okay, we'll leave it then. We got a full rejuve, which we will be saving for endgame, that's for sure. I like that these guys can open doors. I think that's such a cool mechanic. It's just such a small thing that makes such a big difference. Get there already in the corner. All right. Whew. Sorry, I feel like I'm talking a lot less because I'm just trying to stay focused here. We're doing fine health wise. Ooh, the mushroom patch. That helps. That's a good that's a good mission. And fungal tome. Too much baggage. Okay, we need the fungal tome. We gotta that bring that. Didn't do anything. Okay. Let's just go back to town and let's do this fungal patch right away. Oh boy. Okay. We have stuff. Yes, we have blue stuff. Hello, my friend. Stay a while and listen. Ring hit points. Which is honestly not what we need. I think we're I think this ring 34 hit points is just not worth losing the res over it. So and our other one gives us hit points Greetings. anyways. It's always a pleasure to see one of my best customers. Oh, thanks, I buddy. Know that you've been venturing deeper into the labyrinth. And there's a story I was told that you may find worth the time to listen to. I'm listening, man. One of the men who returned from the labyrinth told me about a mystic anvil that he came across during his escape. His description reminded me of legends I had heard in my youth about the burning hellforge where powerful weapons of magic are crafted. The legend had it that deep within the hellforge rested the anvil of fury. This anvil contained within it the very essence of the demonic underworld. It is said that any weapon crafted upon the burning anvil is imbued with great power. If this anvil is indeed the anvil of fury, I may be able to make you a weapon capable of defeating even the darkest lord of hell. Find the anvil for me, and I'll get to work. Okay. That's gonna get us a new weapon. And I think that new weapon is Griswold Sword. I don't remember how good it is, but I know it's definitely better than this. Well, Damn. What can I do for you? What ails you, my friend? Hello, my friend. Stay a while and listen. Let's talk to the witch. Because the mushroom is gonna help. What do we have here? Interesting. It looks like a book of reagents. Keep mm -hmm. your eyes open for a black mushroom. Mm -hmm. It should be fairly large and easy to identify. Mm -hmm. If you find it, bring it to me, won't you? Okay. It's a big black mushroom that I need. Now run off and get it for me so that I can use it for a special concoction that I am working on. I sense a soul in search of <laughs> I'm trying answers. to sell something to you, woman. Mm. 
Mmm. A lot of money there. Wow. Okay. Well, we know we're gonna get a better weapon. I'm not too sure when you get the anvil. I would assume you get it in the cave. What ails you, my friend? Okay. We just got two missions in one level, and it's really exciting. Now, I sense a soul in search of answers. I'm pretty sure the mushroom gives you an elixir that gives you plus one to all attributes, or plus one to a specific attribute, something like that. Now that's one big mushroom. I said so fucking cheesy. You know, I probably shouldn't have went right away for that potion. Okay. We're also almost done with this level. Shot of that guy. So doing our 10 to 27, which is better than 9 to 26, I think is what it was before. Or was it 9 to 27? I don't know. Damn, I just love looking at our health stat or our vitality stat. It's just so high. Great axe. There's nothing in there. We've done a circle. That's the one that goes back to town, okay. We could go back to town right now just to get the mushroom thing out of the way. Let's do it. Oh my god, look at that thing. Whoa, what can I do for you? 625, wow. You got new stuff? Wait. Armor. 15 all res. Faster hit recovery. Shield of Vim, only three defense though. A long sword that gives us all res. Fast swing. Not the greatest. Save. All right, let's go to the witch and see what we got. This will be perfect for mm -hmm. a brew that I am creating. By the way, the healer is looking for the brain of some demon or another so he can treat those who have been afflicted by their poisonous venom. I believe that he intends to make an elixir from it. If you help him find what he needs, please see if you can get a sample of the elixir for me. Okay. I sense a soul in search of answers. Bone spirit. Okay. Hmm. Sucks with the healer. Hmm. Hey, healer. What ails you, my friend? 
The witch told me that you were searching for the brain of a demon to assist me in creating my elixir. Yeah. It should be of great value to the many who were injured by those foul beasts. Okay. If I can just unlock the secrets, I suspect that its alchemy holds. Okay. If you can remove the brain of a demon when you kill it, I would be grateful if you could bring it to me. Okay. Let's uh, go do that. Dude, how much... Drop all that. How are you? Good day. How may I serve you? Yeah, none. All right. I suspect the first thing we kill is gonna drop something that we can grab. I think there's still some enemies in here. Oh yeah. Is that a no? Oh, this big open area. Get over here, dude. Rest in peace, my friend. Oh my god, a breastplate? Let's see what the... F Look at that thing. Oh, dude, get over here. Stop running. Wait, did we just find a staff of bone spirit? We did. Should be worth some money since the book costs so much. Okay, we got everything out. So this level is done. Let's go back to town one more time. Let's go get the elixir. Let's check out this breastplate. 22 compared to... Okay, so it's just a slight upgrade. But it could have some amazing attributes. So if not, at least it's going to be worth some damn money. Uh, let's talk to Pepin. Is that his name? Pepin? Excellent! This is just what I had in mind. Okay. I was able to finish the elixir without this, but it can't hurt to have this to study. Yes. Would you please carry this to the witch? I believe that she is expecting it. Uh, let's just Hello, do this real quick. Friend. Stay a while and listen. Vitality in all res or strength in fire res? I think the all res is better, but... We'll sell it. It should be worth a damn Whoa, pretty penny. What can I do for you? Yeah. That fire res is nice, though. Could come in handy just to keep in case you run into fire enemies, but it's fine. What? Now you bring me that elixir from the healer? Oh, I was able to finish my brew without it. Why don't you just keep it? But what? what does this do? That gave a couple to everything, did it not? I know it helped magic. Maybe vitality a little bit? Strength? Yeah, I, I got some stuff to sell to you still. In search of answers. Yeah, wow, that, that was a lot. Now, do you sell elixirs, or does he sell elixirs now? I know someone now sells elixirs. Also, let's go talk to the farmer. So, you're the hero everyone's been talking about. Hey! Perhaps you could help a poor, simple farmer out of a terrible mess? At the edge of my orchard, well, just south of here, there's a horrible thing swelling out of the ground. I can't get to my crops or my bales of hay, and my poor cows will starve. The witch gave this to me and said that it would blast that thing out of my field. If you could destroy it, I would be forever grateful. I do it myself, but someone has to stay here with the cows. Love it. Okay. Um, let's talk to Pepin and see if he sells elixirs now. They're really expensive, but like, they'll give you one point to a specific stat, I believe. What ails you, my friend? 
Not yet, but maybe he will in time. Okay. I'm gonna pick up all this. Just so we can see what we have all together. Sixty-six thousand. Okay. Our sword's doing fine. I suspect when we get to the next level, though, it's gonna be a lot more difficult for it to for us to kill stuff. Let me check time and see if we can start the next. Okay. A little short on time, but. I think what we're going to do is, we're going to start the DLC, which is this. So you take the bomb, drop it in there, and let's go. We still have the anvil, which I think will be next. We have long lain dormant, and the time to awaken has come. After our long sleep, we are filled with great hunger. Soon, now, we shall feed. Okay. The Defiler. So this is part of the DLC, and I think... It wasn't actually approved by the creators of Diablo 1. They sought out to make a DLC. However, this is what they came with, and they thought it was too goofy, not serious enough. For what Diablo is. What kind of game it is. So they said no to it. Um, but luckily for us, it is a couple levels of being able to get some more XP, some more money, some more loot, importantly. It may be a good item or two. Now, these guys are much easier, too, compared to what we were fighting. Less annoying. For sure. Those guys do some damn damage. Ooh. Ooh. Where is it? Okay. Okay, we like this. We like this already. In my scrolls. Is that leather armor or is that rags? Rope. Okay, that guy did some fucking damage. Great sword. Two handed sword. Oh man. We are finding some stuff. Let's go here. This looks like a little dead end. Maybe? Definitely. Very nice. Let's go. Okay, okay. DOC's treating us well right now, that's for sure. I like the music in here. It's very chill. Town teleporter, very nice. Convenient. Not that high of density, these guys hit like a truck. Another two-handed sword. These have knockback on them too. God, they do a lot of damage. Those guys hit like those big dudes with the fucking uh, horn heads. Like they hit as hard as like what you thought those guys would hit. Like, save. Let's save. Let's save. Let's move. Let's move. Let's move. Uh, let's go this way. Alright, we just gotta be careful for those horn dudes. Those dudes hit hard, man. They hit hard. 
Okay, so we might not be able to clear another cable up at the moment, but we definitely could probably clear one of these. And the items that are dropping are just extraordinary, at least so far. We got a ring, we got a blue gray sword, which should be worth some damn money. Look at this thing, this thing will be worth some money too. Just looks badass. Okay, before we go into the big open area, let's... Those little guys hit hard. What are you? Okay, 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 okay. Jesus Christ. Can't really fucking see what's going on here. Okay. Look at that gold goal. I know more dropped. I know uh, armor dropped over here. Leather armor, but it's white, so who cares? Okay. Experience is going up fairly noticeably. And I think there's only a couple of levels in this. Uh, DLC. It's only like three levels max, I think, and two bosses. I think with how much magic it takes for us to do one healing spell, we might as well up magic a little bit so we could get a benefit of being able to use two of those instead of just one. I think that'd be worth it. Dude, my hit chance is just... My hit chance never felt like it was ever like, wow, okay, I'm hitting consistently. Spiked club. Bush in a full rejuvenation. Okay. I still like those little wongs in the music. Small shield, but it's blue. We'll see what it's about. Oh no. Definitely not a small shield, that's for sure. Blacksmith oil. Where'd that shield go? Okay. Wait, I saw something. Is that what I saw? Okay. Alright. Let's go back to town. Let's up these uh, things. See what we get from them. I guess we'll kill this little area. Um, maybe something good, maybe not. I think the only thing I'm actually looking forward to is just that ring could have something really nice in it. Everything else, I don't think, is gonna do much. The giant sword, probably not gonna be good enough to replace the shield and weapon. Come on, dudes. Okay. What do we got in here? Nothing? Cool. Yeah, we got robe, which is actually just white. Small shield. Could replace ours. 
Giant Sword, don't think it's going to do much, but be a big money grab. And then the uh, the ring, which, who knows. At this high of a level, I would assume it, the ring would be pretty damn good. Hello, my friend. Stay a while ring. Listen. Mana, magic. Wow. Great sword. Strength. Shield. Wow. This. This we're going to hold on to, actually. We're going to keep it on the side in case we ever want to cast... Ooh, that just changed... This just Whoa, changed the game, dude. Hold you? on. Hold on. Get these damn robes out of here. No, we don't want to sell the ring. Oh, dude, that just changed the game right here, this thing. Dude, that's nuts. What ails you, my friend? Okay, so we have elixirs here now. They're 5k a pop, and they give you one to an attribute. Um, All we got here is magic, though. We'll get a strength one. Why not? So, let's see. One to strength. Boom. That just got our damage up too, which is really nice. Let's save. Okay. Let's end this episode with just going over gear at the moment, right? So, we got a lot of money. About 60k. We still have the same weapon, but... However, we have a quest for the anvil, which will get us a better weapon. So, we'll hold on to this guy until then. We have our crown, 15 vitality, very nice, a lot of health from that. I mean, 30 health from that. We got our amulet, which gives us lightning res, very nice, 5 to magic, pretty decent. Our armor, 11 ol res, uh, 13 vitality, netting us about 25 health. This gem we just found, 26 ol res. That is what we need to proceed into the the cave and probably into how later uh, and feel comfortable. We got a ring of truth still from the beginning of the game. Still great. 10 all res, 10 hit points. And then we got our five to all attributes here. Um, we got this gem here. 35 the mana and 11 the magic. This we're going to keep on the side in case we ever need to pop something on to do a town portal, to do a spell, or even a guardian if we got a room full of things Whoa, that we just want to do some I damage do to you? it, right? So that was all very, very nice. And next episode... This is what we're going to get into next episode. Next episode, we're going to get into the DLC as well as continuing into the cave. I'm surprised by the luck we're having. It seems as soon as I need something replaced, we end up finding something. And we're getting real lucky. We got the lucky anvil mission as well, so we could replace our weapon soon without having to spend an enormous amount of money. And with the shield that we just got, what I'm looking at as the thing that we need to replace sooner rather than later would be either our amulet, our other ring, or our armor. Um, everything else is pretty good. The crown could get replaced, but honestly, it's giving us a lot of life. So pretty much just the weapon at this point. Everything else looks fantastic. So yeah, we'll see what next episode brings us. I think next episode we're going to finish the DLC. I think it's only two levels. I think it's three levels max. We're already done with one. So I think we have two more levels and they go by rather quickly. Or will, or there's three. So I think next episode we'll finish all of the DLC and then we'll start getting cracking through the cave and getting into hell, which scary, scary. And I've only really been to that part of the game very few times. And I don't think I've ever been, I usually get stuck at the end of the cave with the warrior. I think I've been to hell once, maybe. So New ground for me as well. But anyway, guys, that's it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe, hit the bell notifications to get my videos as soon as they drop. All right, guys, 
And I'll see you guys in the next one. Maybe I guess, why am I reloading? This isn't Call of Duty! Wait, does that pause it? I'm guessing it does. No, it does not! Oh my god, I don't want to walk towards her. I'm closing my eye. Oh, it's worse! We're just running. Ooh! Oh my god!